In the expansive and often unforgiving landscapes of deserts, drone technology has unveiled chilling discoveries that captivate the imagination. These aerial devices, equipped with advanced sensors and cameras, navigate vast stretches of arid terrain to uncover hidden mysteries that lie beneath the desert sands. Join us as we explore such discoveries, including when a drone made a chilling discovery in the desert that no one was supposed to see. 17. Monster in the Desert In the vast expanse of the desert, a drone made a chilling discovery in the desert that no one was supposed to see. It was a typical day for a drone operator surveying the arid landscape of the American Southwest. Little did they know, high above the ground, their drone would stumble upon something that defied explanation. The operator zoomed in, adjusting the focus to reveal a creature unlike anything documented before. Its skeletal structure bore resemblance to marine life, yet it was unmistakably out of place in this harsh terrestrial environment, a creature that would refuse to surrender. The creature's bones, meticulously preserved by the dry desert climate, hinted at a history shrouded in mystery. It bore no resemblance to the typical desert fauna. Its elongated limbs and oddly shaped skull suggested an evolutionary path divergent from any known species. The skeletal remains, although weathered by time, retained a peculiar sheen that hinted at a once-living creature of substantial size. Theories ran wild among experts as they analyzed the drone footage and subsequent images captured on site. The teeth and bone structure ruled out familiar desert dwellers like reptiles or mammals known to inhabit such regions. 16. Rare Ancient Scroll In the heart of the Judean desert, where rugged cliffs and ancient caves hold secrets of millennia past, a remarkable discovery unfolded. An ancient scroll, its fragments whispering tales of the past. This wasn't just any scroll. It bore fragments of biblical verses inscribed in Greek, with the sacred name of God appearing in Hebrew, a juxtaposition of languages and beliefs echoing through time. The journey to uncover these relics was not for the faint-hearted. Accessible only by scaling down treacherous cliffs, these caves once sheltered Jewish rebels who sought refuge after a failed revolt against Roman rule in the second century. For centuries, these hidden sanctuaries remained undisturbed until recent efforts by Israeli archaeologists to safeguard them from looters revealed their long-guarded secrets. The thrill of discovery echoed through the archaeological team as they carefully unearthed these fragile remnants. Excitement rippled among them as they realized they had stumbled upon verses from the books of Zechariah and Nahum, prophetic texts dating back to the era surrounding the birth of Christ. These scriptures, meticulously penned on parchment, provided invaluable insights into ancient Jewish beliefs and practices, resonating with historical and religious significance. 15. Cadillac Ranch Nestled in the expansive plains of the Amarillo Desert, Texas, lies a peculiar drone discovery that defies the ordinary, the Cadillac Ranch. This iconic public art installation, conceived in 1974 by the avant-garde art collective known as Ant Farm, consists of 10 vintage Cadillacs buried nose-first into the earth. It's not just a whimsical display of automotive eccentricity, it's a tribute to the evolution of American car culture and an enduring testament to artistic expression in the heartland of Texas. Each Cadillac, ranging from models dating back to 1949 to 1963, stands at an angle mirroring the famous pyramids of Giza, a deliberate nod to ancient architectural marvels in a modern roadside setting. Originally situated in a wheat field, the installation was later moved westward in 1997 to its current location along Interstate 40, a strategic shift to accommodate Amarillo's urban growth while preserving its accessibility to curious travelers and art enthusiasts alike.
the brainchild of architects Chip Lord and Doug Michaels, alongside art student Hudson Marquez, Cadillac Ranch was born from a blend of architectural subversion and artistic audacity. Inspired by a chance encounter with a children's book on car design, the trio envisioned a spectacle that would fuse nostalgia for mid-century automotive aesthetics with a bold statement on consumerism and cultural identity. 14. Hand of the Desert This monumental sculpture in the desert, crafted by the Chilean artist Mario Irarazabal in the early 1980s, reaches a towering 30 feet into the sky, its massive fingers extending as if in a desperate plea to touch the heavens. Situated southeast of Antofagasta, Chile, along the desolate Pan-American Highway, and drone footage of it is absolutely amazing. Funded by Corporación Pro Antofagasta, a local booster organization, Ira Razabal's creation stands as a symbol of both artistic expression and the resilience of the human spirit against the backdrop of one of the world's driest and most inhospitable terrains. The Hand of the Desert is not merely a static artwork, it is a magnet for travelers and explorers drawn to its enigmatic presence in the midst of Chile's lunar-like desert landscape. Its colossal scale and stark contrast against the backdrop of the Atacama serve as a powerful reminder of the intersection between art and environment, prompting contemplation on the themes of isolation, yearning, and the limitless reach of human endeavor. 13. Sandfall In Saudi Arabia's desert landscapes, an intriguing phenomenon has captured the attention of both locals and global observers alike. The mysterious sandfalls. Unlike traditional waterfalls that cascade with water, these sandfalls that were filmed by a drone appear to flow with grains of sand pouring over cliffs and ridges, resembling a surreal imitation of their aquatic counterparts. First documented in drone videos circulating on social media, these sandfalls occur near Riyadh. The videos depict what seems like a deluge of sand cascading down dry slopes, creating a spectacle that defies conventional expectations of desert terrain. Scientists and local authorities attribute these phenomena to the rare occurrence of intense rainstorms that trigger flash floods in Saudi Arabia's arid regions. Known for its wadis, dry riverbeds that remain parched for much of the year, Saudi Arabia experiences sporadic but powerful rain events that can transform these normally bone-dry landscapes into temporary rivers of sand and water. The geological conditions in Saudi Arabia play a crucial role in the formation of these sandfalls. With minimal vegetation and porous soils, unable to absorb large volumes of water quickly, the desert surface becomes a conduit for runoff during heavy rains. This runoff, laden with sediment and debris, gathers momentum as it rushes downhill, carrying along grains of sand that spill over edges, creating the illusion of a sandfall. 12. Ship in the Desert, a tale as old as the age of exploration itself, has resurfaced. An extraordinary desert discovery that no one is supposed to see. It has captured the imagination of archaeologists and historians alike. The fabled ship in the desert, laden with treasures lost for over five centuries. The Bomb Jesus, a stout Portuguese vessel, embarked on its ill-fated voyage from Lisbon on March 7, 1533, bound for the riches of India. Laden with a cargo that included gold coins, copper ingots, and various artifacts, the tempestuous seas, notorious for their unpredictability, forced the Bomb Jesus perilously close to shore, where it met its tragic fate, colliding with a submerged rock and capsizing in the violent surf. For centuries, the Bomb Jesus lay obscured beneath the shifting sands of time and the Namib Desert, preserved in an almost surreal tableau of abandonment. It wasn't until 2008, amidst diamond mining operations in the Spergebiet, the Forbidden Territory, that the ship's remnants were unearthed, a testament to the relentless forces of nature and the enduring allure of lost treasures. 
The discovery was nothing short of miraculous, an intact treasure trove hidden in the desert's embrace. Among the artifacts retrieved were over 2,000 pristine gold coins, copper ingots weighing tens of thousands of pounds, and a cache of relics ranging from bronze bowls to muskets and cannons. Each find added layers to the historical narrative of the bomb Jesus, shedding light on its final moments and the resilience of its crew amidst catastrophe. 11. Ergchech Meteorite Ergchech is not just any meteorite, it is a stony meteorite, rare and remarkable for its composition and age. Dating back a staggering four to six billion years, it ranks among the oldest meteorites ever unearthed. What makes this meteorite particularly significant is its composition of aluminum-26, an element crucial for dating celestial objects like meteorites. Surprisingly, Ergchech contained higher levels than expected, challenging previous assumptions about its distribution across the solar system. Scientists theorize that the elevated levels of aluminum-26 in Ergchech suggest its origins in a protoplanet. This revelation forces a re-evaluation of existing dating methods for meteorites. Previously, it was assumed that it was uniformly distributed across space. Now it appears that its presence is more sporadic, influencing the formation and composition of celestial bodies in varying ways. Studying Ergchech also sheds light on the geological diversity of meteorites. Its andesitic composition, resembling volcanic rocks found on Earth, suggests a complex history involving volcanic activity on its parent body, enriches our understanding of early planetary processes and the conditions that prevailed during the solar system's infancy. 10. The biggest dinosaur ever. In the deserts of Patagonia, Argentina, a colossal tale unfolds, a story of ancient giants that once roamed the Earth. It begins with a chilling discovery by a local farm worker near La Flecha, where the earth revealed fragments of bones, hinting at a creature of unprecedented size and magnitude. This ancient behemoth, a newly discovered species of titanosaur, now holds the title of the largest dinosaur ever known. Stretching an astounding 100 feet from head to tail and standing over 40 feet tall when its neck was extended, this herbivorous leviathan weighed a staggering 77 tons, equivalent to the mass of 14 African elephants. The significance of this discovery extends beyond mere size. It offers a glimpse into the distant past, approximately 95 to 100 million years ago during the late Cretaceous period. Here, in the dense forests of Patagonia, this titanosaur peacefully grazed, its colossal frame a testament to the lush and abundant environment it once inhabited. Despite its monumental proportions, this newly found titan remains unnamed, an honor that will reflect both its magnificence and the region where it was unearthed, paying homage to the land and those who first alerted scientists to its presence. 9. Atacama Giant A mysterious figure emerges from the desert an ancient giant etched into the hillsides, known as the Atacama Giant. Towering at approximately 400 feet, this anthropomorphic geoglyph stands as one of the largest and most enigmatic prehistoric artworks of its kind. The origins of the Atacama Giant date back to a time lost in the annals of history, crafted by successive cultures that once thrived amidst the harsh landscapes of the Atacama region. Scholars theorize that these ancient peoples, including the Tiwanaku and Inca civilizations, left their mark on this desolate canvas, creating nearly 5,000 geoglyphs over several millennia. Unlike other geoglyphs that remain obscure in purpose, the Atacama giant carries a unique significance. Positioned strategically on Chero Unitas, its colossal form served as an early astronomical calendar the placement of its geometric points and lines facilitated the tracking of lunar movements, crucial for predicting seasonal changes and agricultural cycles in the unforgiving desert environment. 
While interpretations vary, some experts suggest that the figure represents a shaman or spiritual entity embodying the mystical beliefs and rituals of ancient Andean cultures. However, the evidence supporting such claims remains sparse, leaving much of the giant's symbolism shrouded in mystery. 8. Wreckage of the World War II Plane In the searing heat of the Egyptian Sahara Desert, a remarkable discovery has emerged. An artifact frozen in time, echoing the chilling drama of the World War II North African campaign. Nestled amidst the dunes, far from any modern settlement, lies the wreckage of a British Royal Air Force fighter, a poignant testament to a young pilot's fateful journey. The story begins as German General Erwin Rommel's Africa Corps relentlessly pursued British forces across the unforgiving desert terrain. Amidst this chaotic backdrop, Flight Sergeant Dennis Copping embarked on a crucial mission to ferry a Kitty Hawk P-40 fighter from one RAF base to another for urgent repairs. However, fate intervened as mechanical issues with the plane's front landing gear forced Copping off course, steering him deeper into the vast, barren expanse. Dennis, just 24 years old and part of the RAF's 260 squadron stationed in Egypt, found himself disoriented as he struggled to navigate his way back. Another RAF pilot attempted to signal him. The desert swallowed his intentions and the Kitty Hawk succumbed to the desert's embrace. Nearly seven decades later, a Polish oil company worker stumbled upon the remarkably preserved wreckage. The discovery, hailed as miraculous by experts, revealed a scene frozen in time. 7. Gates to Hell The Turkmen Desert hides a chilling spectacle no one was supposed to see, the Gates to Hell, also known as the Darvaza Gas Crater. This eerie phenomenon, captured vividly through drone footage, unveils a landscape unlike any other on Earth. Located in the heart of the Karakum Desert, the Darvaza Gas Crater is a surreal sight. The origins of this fiery crater date back to 1971, when a Soviet drilling rig accidentally punctured a massive underground natural gas cavern. In an attempt to control the release of methane gas, the ground beneath the rig collapsed, forming the crater we see today. Fearing the spread of toxic gases, the engineers decided to set the crater on fire, hoping it would burn out within a few weeks. Little did they anticipate that over five decades later, the Darvaza gas crater would still be burning relentlessly, casting an eerie glow over the desert sands. Its fiery inferno can be seen from miles away, making it a beacon in the night sky of the Turkmen Desert. From above, captured by drones, the Darvaza crater appears like a portal to another world, a swirling vortex of flames dancing amidst the darkness. The drone footage reveals the edges of the crater, its depths glowing with an otherworldly intensity. 6. The Giant Eye of Africa The Richat structure, also known as the Eye of the Sahara or the Blue Eye of Africa, resembles a gigantic eye when viewed from above, thanks to drone technology, making it a prominent landmark even visible from space. From the silent heights of a drone, the Risha structure unfolds like a cosmic work of art, etched into the barren expanse of the desert. Its perfectly circular shape, with concentric rings spreading out from a central hub, presents a sight that is both mesmerizing and enigmatic. The drone footage captures the intricate details of the structure's vast expanse, revealing the symmetrical patterns that stretch across the landscape. Initially believed to be the remnant of a meteoroid impact due to its circular formation, while some theories proposed it was a volcanic formation, the absence of volcanic rocks within the structure contradicted this hypothesis. Instead, the prevailing belief today is that it formed through the gradual erosion of an ancient dome of rock. What adds to the mystery is the uniformity of the concentric rings surrounding the central peak, each ring spaced equidistantly from the center. This peculiar geometric arrangement defies easy explanation, 
contributing to the allure and scientific intrigue surrounding the Rishat structure. From a geological perspective, the Rishat structure offers a unique window into the Earth's past. The layers of rock exposed by erosion provide valuable insights into the geological history of the region. Scientists study these layers to understand the processes of sedimentation, uplift, and erosion that have shaped this distinctive feature over geological timescales. 5. Giant Fish-Shaped Rock Khaled Alinazi, navigating the skies with his drone, stumbled upon a geological marvel that has since captured the imagination of viewers worldwide, a colossal rock formation resembling an immense fish, aptly named Desert Fish. Khaled, recounting his find, describes how the landscape suddenly revealed a mountainous shape that unmistakably resembled a fish, seemingly emerging from the sea of sand. His aerial footage, now viral across social media platforms, showcases the rock's striking features, with its dorsal fins and tail protruding boldly against the desert backdrop. While some online speculators whimsically pondered whether the formation might be the fossilized remains of a prehistoric sea creature, he clarified that this majestic desert fish is, in fact, composed of sandstone. 4. A giant crack in the desert. A colossal crack split open the barren desert landscape, stretching an astonishing two miles in length. This remarkable earth fissure, unveiled through drone footage by the Arizona Geological Survey, has captured both awe and concern due to its immense size and potential for expansion. The fissure, located between Casa Grande and Tucson, presents a dramatic sight, so vast that people walking along its edges appear minuscule in comparison. As geologists have observed, the crack's northern section, although older and partially filled, displays shallower depths. In stark contrast, the southern part plunges tens of feet into the earth at certain points, revealing a complex terrain of varying widths and depths. While the crack itself poses no immediate threat to populated areas, there are potential safety concerns. The geologist warns against approaching the fissure, particularly for recreational activities such as off-road vehicle riding due to the risk of accidental falls or entrapment. Despite its remote location in the desert, the fissure's unpredictable nature and expansive reach underscore the need for cautious monitoring and public awareness. Looking ahead, he anticipates that the crack will continue to grow in length over time. What currently appears as a surface crack is merely a visible manifestation of a deeper underlying fissure, suggesting ongoing geological processes at play beneath the desert floor. 3. The Kalahari Desert's Fairy Circles Unlike their whimsical name might suggest, there are no mythical beings at play in the formation of these fairy circles in the desert. Instead, two prominent theories have vied for scientific consensus over the years. One hypothesis points to termites as the architects, suggesting these insects create the circles by damaging grass roots. The opposing theory focuses on the evolutionary adaptation of desert grasses, proposing that competition for water resources leads to the formation of these circular patches. Recent research led by Stefan Getzin, an ecologist from the University of Göttingen in Germany, has brought fresh insights into this enduring mystery. Using advanced drone technology and extensive field studies in Namibia's Namibrand Nature Reserve, Stefan and his team embarked on a quest to unravel the secrets of these fairy circles. Their findings challenge long-held beliefs and shed new light on the ecological dynamics at play in one of the world's harshest environments. Research spanning over two decades since his initial studies in 2000 has yielded groundbreaking discoveries about the fairy circles' inner workings. Unlike previous theories that attributed the circles solely to termites or random patterns of plant growth, the Stefan team uncovered a sophisticated mechanism of self-organization among desert grasses. Through soil moisture measurements and grass excavation studies during dry and wet seasons, he observed a complex interplay of ecological factors. 
The barren centers of the fairy circles act as reservoirs, where moisture is conserved and redistributed by surrounding grasses through intricate root systems. 2. Underground Cave City This ancient labyrinthine settlement, nestled within vast lowest land pits, boasts nearly 10,000 courtyard homes intricately carved out of the natural sedimentary rock. From above, drone footage reveals a mesmerizing sight, a series of prism-like dwellings in the desert that span the landscape like an ancient city frozen in time. Each home is meticulously designed, with walls strengthened by the natural materials of the pit walls. The caves, with depths ranging from 20 to 23 feet and lengths spanning 33 to 39 feet, showcase the ingenuity of ancient Chinese craftsmanship and architectural prowess. These subterranean abodes, now under strict government conservation efforts, offer a glimpse into the rich history and culture of the region. Originally carved out centuries ago, they served as residences for local communities, providing shelter and security against the elements and potential invaders. Today, they stand as a testament to the enduring legacy of the people who once inhabited this remarkable underground city. 1. Mary Man Known as the Mary Man or Stuart's Giant, this colossal geoglyph sprawls across the plateau near Finnis Springs. The story of the Mary Man begins with an aerial discovery by a pilot, whose routine drone flight over central Australia revealed the intricate outlines of the figure in the desert below. Depicting an indigenous Australian man, possibly wielding a boomerang or a throwing stick known as a woomera, the geoglyph's precision and scale immediately sparked speculation about its creators and purpose. Local lore and theories abound regarding the identity of those behind the Mary Man's creation. Some claim it was the work of professionals due to its meticulous execution, purportedly marked out using bamboo skewers spaced at regular intervals. This method, coupled with the geoglyph's exactitude in an era when GPS technology was still nascent, over the years, various theories have emerged regarding the geoglyph's origins. Initial suspicions pointed to American artists, fueled by anonymous faxes sent to local media and businesses using U.S. spellings and cultural references. These clues, including a plaque adorned with the U.S. flag and Olympic rings found near the site, suggested a potential international connection. However, skepticism remains, with some arguing that these could have been deliberate diversions to obscure the true creator's identities. Which one was the most chilling? Let us know in the comments.